Pearl's been fibbing to us, okay? Like I said, a lot of people are really confused by just pearly things. Just imagine this woman as a divorced mom of twins who does not work a normal job. She gets a fat ass alimony check and child support. And her ex is like a corporate lawyer or something, right? And Pearl's just always complaining about like, you know, like her boys piss gold. Right. 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 This is Rodman 2023. Bitches. Hello, welcome to the vlog. Yes, this is a slumber party vlog. I've been editing while Patrick was watching football and stuff, so hanging out with Frank here. He's sitting down here on the floor. I'm not gonna move him because he's comfy, so yeah. That was our uh, air freshener automatic thing. Sometimes it goes off and I'm like, that sounds like not good. So anyways, let me adjust you here. So yeah, we're just hanging out tonight. There is actually, we like to cook things in the crock pot overnight. So we have um, a roast in the crock pot right now. Fill up. The other fun thing I've been doing today is keeping Frank off the tree. So that's been great. But um, yeah, it's just, all I did was edit today and then just kind of, I got dressed for the day and stuff, even though I didn't go anywhere, mailed off a package, but yeah, just working on my Desert Murmur. You saw me working on that. And then watching the YouTubes while I was editing and stuff. Booty Beauty says she's going back to Canada. <sighs> Fingers crossed, right guys? Right? If you watch Girl World, you know. So, I was checking in with just pearly things. And... There's some big news with just pearly things. You know, I like to call her just fucked up things. So, I have been telling you guys. Pearl. I, I feel like Pearl's been fibbing to us, okay? Like I said, a lot of people are really confused by just pearly things. Well, if you just... Just imagine, Pearl is a divorced mom of twins. Remember this, I've told you this in another vlog. You just imagine this woman as a divorced mom of twins who does not work a normal job. She gets a fat ass alimony check and child support. And her ex is like a corporate lawyer or something, right? And Pearl is just always complaining about like her her ex-husband and the alimony check and and raising the twins and all the other moms and you know women and stuff because her boys her boys are god's gift to earth right not just women to earth you know like her boys piss gold type deal right that's pearl so just pearly things you know, just gets on these, like, coffee talks and stuff. And she just spits out, like, you know, oh, um, older women shouldn't dress this way. And you shouldn't do this. And blah, blah, blah. Well, <sighs> Pearl finally copped up in a video as to why she thinks all these things about why women of a certain age and dress like hoes as she would call it while a women are you know not grateful for the men they have why older women shouldn't be with younger men she finally admitted she finally legitimized the twins in a video i'm not kidding she was, it was a coffee talk. I recorded it for us. I recorded it for us. I mean, hold on. 
I hate how it, no, 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 no. I hate how it always starts playing. But she finally copped in this video, you guys, to the twins being real, to them existing, that Pearl is actually a divorcee mama twins who has too much time on her hands, so she makes these videos to, I don't know, fill up her time, act like she's a know-it-all, be the annoying future mother-in-law we know she's going to be, which she used to complain the fuck out of her, about her ex-mother-in-law. She used to put that woman down all the time. Like, I mean, she couldn't even put a nice Shabbat dinner together for her ex-mother-in-law at all. She couldn't do that. She just, she tried Shabbat dinner once and she fucked it up. And she was just like, screw it. I'm going back to being Catholic because that is how I was raised anyways. That was Pearl. That was Pearl trying to assimilate into her ex-husband's culture. But anyways, so this is Pearl copying to having twins and the children being real. Oh, shit. Like I said, I'm not good at this. Okay, here we go. Girl. But you... You should just mind your own business. Well, I could. But, you know, my kids have to grow up with their kids. Um, so it's like... I mean, if no one says anything, then we have these people that are just like half naked walking around here. You heard that, right? You heard that? I had it nice and loud. My kids have to exist in a world with their kids. I think we need to hear that again. Like I've been telling you, this woman has kids. She is a, she is a divorced mama twins. And these kids are real. And she's making sure they go to fucking Harvard. Because her husband going to Princeton wasn't good enough, apparently. Her ex-husband no like she should have she she goes all the time she goes to her one friend she has this one friend you know she's always like oh, i know i should have married that guy from harvard like oh, what was i thinking marrying some dude from princeton <laughs> so that's pearl anyway so let's hear this shit again pearl but you you should just mind your own business well i could but, you know, my kids have to grow up with their kids. Um, so it's like... The fuck? I mean, if no one says anything, then we have these... People. Well, we have you saying something, right? Because, God forbid, you know, one of the twins came home from their father's house and said, Hey, you know, Dad gets Sports Illustrated. And Martha Stewart was on the cover of the swimsuit. And she's kind of, she's kind of hot, Mom. She freaked the fuck out. So anyways, so the twins are raising money to go to Washington, D.C. At the end of the school year, you know, everybody does this. And Pearl, her sons can't sell candy bars. They can't sell that fucking wrapping paper. They can't even sell the fucking frozen cookie dough, okay? That's not good enough for Pearl's boys, okay? Her sons are going to fucking Harvard one day, okay? They need some shit to put on their resume, okay? So, and you know, Pearl's got her weird ideas because she, she's low-key trying to get back at her ex-husband by doing all this shit. I don't think if you realize that. And her ex-mother-in-law, okay? And, you know, just rage against, you know, all the women who are still married on the PTA. Anyways, so yeah, that's some gossip if you ever want to get into that. <laughs> so anyway, so Pearl's raising money with her sons for the DC trip. This is how they plan to raise the money for the DC trip, okay? I'm going to show you here. She's got a great idea for the twins to make tons of money. Like, they're going to have leftover money. Today I have... My women shouldn't vote t-shirt. These t-shirts are the best in the game. Super soft, amazing. You will never find a t-shirt like this in your life. And it's amazing because I go out and I'm on the streets and everyone comes up to me and just asks me where I bought this t-shirt. 
you can get yours too with the audacity no one ever network. no one ever no one no one no you don't need to hear that website it's bullshit anyways yeah that's how how the twins are gonna raise the money to go to dc is by selling that shirt right there <laughs> i know pearl's a fucking dumbass right like women don't even claim pearl anymore like Mm, yeah. Your sons are never getting laid, Pearl. Do you realize this? Like, damn. Like. Damn. So anyways, yeah. I've just been fucking around and watching YouTube and whatnot. Hanging out. Snacking. Drinking coffee. I... Patrick was going to put, have them put Vlogmas Day 4 on my cup, but he forgot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, so I did it myself. Um, I was going to ask because I wanted to prove the point. I've seen Alicia has been carrying around a, a Sharpie. I've been watching her Vlogmas, guys, and her Vlogmas intro was actually really good. I was proud of her because... She had to learn how to do a new skill for After Effects. Like I've been saying, learn a new skill. And so she had to mask out, like, all these, like, of her and her outfits and stuff. So it was really cool. Like, go you. Go you. Making a special intro. Having to learn a new skill to do it. Putting it all together. Being like, holy crap, can I make this work? And she did it. So... Girl's on her way. Girl is on her way. So, yeah, I mean, Vlogmas. So, yeah, um, I wanted to prove the point that um, you could probably ask the people to write Vlogmas Day whatever on your cup, and they'll fucking do it. Honestly, I think the problem is that she ain't going to Dutch Brothers. I think the problem is she's in <laughs> Patrick's watching football, and he's like this watching his phone so sorry no i think it's funny i think it's funny so yeah so um i think if alicia was to go to dutch dutch brothers alicia you said you're watching vlogmas and i know you watch me sometimes girl i know i know so um go to dutch brothers find a dutch brothers in la somewhere or i think there's one in riverside there's just just get online and Google it. You know how to do that. And go to Dutch Brothers and ask them at Dutch Brothers to put Vlogmas Day, whatever you go, on your cup. Because Dutch Brothers is this shit. Those people are really chill and they would probably love to put Vlogmas Day, whatever, on her cup. So, yeah. My tip to you, girl. Hit up Dutch Brothers. You know, it would be really cool merch for her and you probably could find like an product like this on drop shipping or something is if alicia had like a you know how i have my like coffee cup and stuff well like you know a coffee cup but like one you could write on with like a dry erase marker or something and then you could write your little messages kind of like how they write the messages on the cup i'm sure there's a cup that does that but wouldn't that be cute and then we can write our own messages every day for vlogmas huh? I know I'm drinking coffee at night. I'm an artist. Like I said, I keep weird hours. All right, Frank. Frank's down here. Let me show you Frank. Let me show you Frank. Hey, Mr. Frank. Phillip's over there on my sweater. There's Mr. Frank. He stole my blanket. Oh, there's Mr. Tammy. There's Mr. Tammy, my babies. Hanging out and watching the YouTubes together. Watching the YouTubes. Good babies. <laughs> this is the shit we've been dealing with. Okay, I gotta be quiet because everybody's in bed. But yeah, I have to show you. I'm gonna steal your blanket. No, Frank. Come on. Get down. Come on. No. Come on. Turn around. Turn around. Good boy. Oh, that's a good boy. Now you're stuck. See? Good boy. Oh, gosh. Cats. Cats. Can I have this water blanket? I don't have a robe. I'm not one of those fancy other YouTubers. Ugh. 
Yes, so I was gonna pull out some of the wigs, but I don't know if I feel like it. It's kind of late. You can see our tree. Isn't that cool? Let's look at this shit. I got this. These are these. See, it's like it hangs in the closet, but you put your wig on it. Isn't that cool? So, yeah. I don't know. I don't know if I want to open this. Maybe we guys can do this tomorrow. Oh, wait. So it's kind of loud. Isn't this one pretty? This one's like a pink. It's like a pink I already have in the cheaper cosplay. I want to show you guys. Hi, Amy. It's a good baby. I'm going to show you guys this one. This one was like on sale and it came in like its own little like box. This is what we do with all my is these cats and they're just like eh, eh. Alright, it's not good. I want to completely take it out so it's see it's like a dark focus. The color sucks here too. The the lighting sucks, you know. I'm one of those walkers, but yeah, isn't that pretty? It's like a dark blue, and I thought it would go really good with like, because I kind of have that neon, neon-y green, you know, that lighter green. Focus on me. Oh, oh, there we go. See the exposure just adjusted, so maybe you can see this a little better. Isn't that nice? It's a nice color blue. Yeah, that's a nice color. So, they're all lace front wings, glueless. All the reviews on Amazon said that it was um, easy for beginners. So I figured there's all these tutorials on YouTube, so we should be fine, right? So this one's like a lighter blue. This is like Swoop. You guys know who Swoop is, right? She does all those like documentary. I like Swoop and how she does her documentaries. I'm very impressed by how she'll have a like a trauma counselor on the set or on standby to talk to the guests when she's interviewing them because she's doing these hardcore subjects. But I really appreciate that because that's something that I feel like a lot of big production teams will fail to do. Which sucks, so. Oh yeah, this one's blue. Like I said, it's kind of like Swoop's blue. And actually, they accidentally, oh, I don't want my phone. They accidentally sent me two of these, so I have two. So I guess I figured when I go and um, cut the lace for the first time, I will probably use one of these because I have two. But I'm gonna watch a ton of tutorials and then go from there. It'll be interesting to see, to get these on the, um, the cap thing and see how um, the cut is on them. Because I'm almost wondering if I could probably take them into the hairstylist and pay them to just kind of, not like a cut cut, because these are like synthetic wigs, so I don't know how much of a haircut you really can give synthetic hair, but like to shape it up in the front a little bit just so there was a little bit of like wisp because like there are like some wispier things i can't i don't want to pull it over on my cosplay wig that i have so yeah i'm hoping that maybe you know um you'll see if you guys go to my community tab actually i have some selfies up there that i took in the cosplay wig which is i actually really love that hair color it's really fun but not practical at all. Oh, Timmy's rolling around on the floor over here. He's so cute. So. I think I'm going to chill. I brought my mirror out here and everything, but we'll just mess with this tomorrow while we're here. You know, um, tomorrow's a work day for everybody but me. Well, I do stuff here, but... I figured that like we can just hang out and we can mess around with the wigs. Um, 
Then we can get to cleaning up my desk area, which I'm dreading cleaning out my desk area, but yeah. I'm trying to think if there's anything going on, on YouTube's. I was on the Reddit, the Snark Reddit earlier, the Alicia and Remy Snark Reddit, and they were all saying they don't like Redmi and Alicia's Vlogmas intros, which, like I said, I actually am impressed by Alicia's intro for Vlogmas because when she showed the behind the scenes, well, she did have the team there. I want her to do more, like, DIY. Like, I know a lot of the editing was her deal, and it is easier to help people shoot things and stuff when especially if you have the money, but I want her to see see her go back to her old school YouTube roots and start doing more of this shit DIY because I think she'd find that she doesn't need this high production crap. She doesn't need to sink a lot of money into this high production bullshit. Like, look, Kiro's trying to find anime to watch. I like watching anime at night. Yes, anime, you guys. I settled. The anime I settled for in Crunchyroll is The Angel Next Door Spoils Me Rotten. It is, I have to read subtitles, so, I mean, way to up my Japanese game. Yeah, I don't speak Japanese, so, there's, well, there's a lot of la languages I, d I don't, sp I only speak one, so. But I'm trying to learn Japanese, so, and I understand Spanish, I can't speak it. I know. I grew up with, you know, if you grow up with relatives who speak Spanish, but you never speak it yourself, you can, you, you end up picking it up, but you just, you know, you don't, I can't speak it. And you know me, I have problems pronouncing words as it is because of my brain tumor, so rolling your tongue and stuff is not for me at all, but let's see. Oh my god, um, earlier this evening in Virginia, there was cops executing like a, um, like a, I think they were trying to arrest a guy or something and get him to come out of his house, and the house just like explodes. Like, they're all surrounding the house, they're trying to get him out, and it just goes, what the, and it's crazy, the footage is crazy, it looks like a set, like, the house was gone and it looked like it was a brick house like everything hanging out brick house it's crazy let's see oh yeah foodie beauty says she's going back to canada we're not holding our breath but we're lighting our prayer candles hmm hmm who's live right now Lookner. He probably wants us to to at him on Twitter. You know, call me when you get home at Lookner. Let's see. Yeah, see here. I was watching this stream earlier publicly buzzed. I don't know who the fuck that is, but he was covering and watching social media to see if anything new came out. This is apparently the guy they were trying to get. This James James U fella. I don't know what he did, I don't know who he is, but apparently that's whose house exploded. They were trying to arrest him. Shit. Hmm. What else is going on? I get, I get recommended the, no I don't want that, no I don't want that. I get recommended the weirdest streams, like plus size Trium stream, and it says like, hey, no fighting, you guys. It's too late. Cats. Um, it'll be like, it's clearly like, it looks like a cam girl live stream. And I'm just like, YouTube, get your shit together. Like, I get recommended several of these where it's like, it just says good morning or like hang out with me. But by the looks of the thumbnail, like you clearly know what they're hanging out and doing on that stream. I don't understand how this shit is on here. But this is what's on here late at night on YouTube. This crap. So, yeah. Fun. I think I'm gonna just end the vlog here, you guys. I mean, like I said, the only thing that happened tonight was that house exploding. 
yeah not a whole lot and i'm kind of tired so we'll rip into those wigs tomorrow i'll let you know how many episodes i got into my anime but yeah i don't know i feel like i'm doing okay on vlogmas i know today was not as exciting but like to be honest like i don't really do a whole lot because i'm homebound and i'm stuck here and whatnot so this is kind of what it's like so that's okay though it's been fun it's it feels like i have someone to hang out with so cats you hear them right you hear them all walking around you can hear them it's like what are you doing you better not be eating that Better not be eating that tree. I want to be able to have a Christmas tree this year, you guys. So, as always, I'm sending lots of love to all you guys. Except for Pearl. Because we have to live in a world with, where Pearl, with Pearl's sons. At least we got her to cop to that. They're all, the twins are real. But, you know, like, we have to live in a world with her kids. So, yeah. Thanks a lot, Pearl. <laughs> I love you guys. I'll see you tomorrow.